Good morning. Today we're doing the eighth video of the Random Lick series, and I'll be playing some drum set for you guys. I got some new ideas I'm gonna be trying out for this one, but most importantly, it's gonna be random. So if this is your first time watching one of my random lick videos, what I do is I write a bunch of random small phrases, cut them up, and then I pick them at random out of my cowbell. And that's how I write the licks. It always turns out super randomly. I also made a playlist of all of the random lick videos. If you want to check them out, the link will be in the description. I'm going to start off this random video by answering three random questions that were left in the comments of the last random lick video that I did. If you have an urgent random question to ask me, compose it down below and maybe I'll answer it in the next one. Okay, so first random question comes from Julian Klimzik. Speaking of random, I have a random question. Excellent. Do you think about switching to snare in the Commandant Zone for a year or something? Okay, so for those of you that might not know, I perform in the Commandant Zone, the United States Marines Drum and Bugle Corps in the quad line. And while the snare drum is a lot lighter than the quads and would definitely be easier on the body, I wouldn't want to switch to it because the quads are so much cooler. I know a lot of my viewers are also quad players, so what do you guys think? Would you switch to snare? Pose a comment and let me know. The next random question comes from P.U. Castellano. Sorry if I butchered your name. The audio sounds a lot nicer. Did you get a new microphone? Well, thank you. I do try to get the best possible audio and video that I can for you guys, but no, I did not use a new microphone. The microphone I used for the random xylophone lick was this one, the Blue Snowball, uh, the one that has like the three settings on the back. And I've been using this same microphone for most of my videos for a few years now. However, the random xylophone lick was one of the first videos where I used Levelator. This is a free program that you just import your audio into it and then it makes all volumes of the audio at about the same level. So when I'm screaming like this, and then I just like whisper all quietly. It'll make that kind of the same level so you can understand what the heck I'm saying. But if you noticed, I bought a new microphone for this video, the Insignia lapel microphone. How do I sound? Is this, is this good? Do I, do I sound good? And I'm able to buy new gear like this with the help of my patrons. Shout out to my squeaky cocks, Mitchell Bueller, Katie Mackey, Ian Stick, and Chris Dietrich. Also a shout out to my big Gox and my holy shots. Thank you so much for your support. If you want to contribute to the madness of this channel, then go on over to the Patreon account. And last random question is from TTV Do The Fig. Is Cowbell selling her bathwater? Well, let's ask her. Are you selling your bathwater, Cowbell? Oh, that's right. Cowbell here is taking a vow of silence to protest the mistreatment of inanimate objects. Because inanimate objects are people too. I mean, just look at how fabulous Cowbell's hair is. But how long should Cowbell's vow of silence last? I asked my morning people to decide for me. By the way, you can become a morning person by clicking that subscribe button. Okay, so I made the cards a little bit differently this time. I actually took the effort to write them out in music software. So you got a nice clean PDF of them, which I will post the link for that music in the description so you guys can go download it and print it out and cut them up and make your own random drum set lick video. I feel like a lot of people don't realize how long it actually takes to import this stuff into music software because doing it by hand is way faster. I save hours doing it that way. So if you appreciate all the effort I went through, then click that like button. And if you do end up creating your own random drum set lick, go ahead and throw in the hashtag random drum set. And also include in the title EMC Productions random drum set lick. Because if you get 100 million views on this video, I want a little bit of credit, okay? Because I came up with the idea. But I'll search for these videos and I'll leave some comments on them. Also, we got our glockenspiel competition going on on this channel. The quest for the second hardest glockenspiel feature of 2019. For full details on how to enter this contest, go check out my hardest glockenspiel feature of 2019 video. Okay, back to the random drum set lick. We are about to start picking the cards, but first, I want to introduce our drum set player, up and coming pop drummer sensation, Lil Peanut. Score! 
And Little Peanut is actually starting to make a name for himself. He was recently hired to go on tour for the world's most famous completely green screened band, Scribe and the Scriblets. If you guys would like to see a live performance from Scribe and the Scriblets, compose a comment below and let me know. Okay, so now we're gonna start picking the cards, but first, a quick commercial break. What the heck? <laughs> Shucker. <laughs> uh, that Steven Sassafras is always up to no good. Hi there. I'm Manny McMahon, intergalactic snare drummer and owner of Manly Man's Man Cave. Here at the Man Cave, we're very proud to introduce our all new product, Steven Sassafras' extreme percussive pranks. Salutations. I'm Steven Sassafras the sixth. And I'm the snare drum section leader. If you purchase my instructional video, you'll learn the finer points of these tricks, such as snipping a slit in the sick bag, <laughs> trying to screw up a concert, simply photoshop out a bar of rest right before the cymbal crash. <laughs> What the heck? <laughs> Sucker. <laughs> or my personal favorite, stuff a bee's nest into the bass drum. <laughs> <laughs> and I'll make I'm sure. Kill you, Steven. Oh, geez. <laughs> Warning: Steven Sassafras's extreme percussive pranks may cause everyone to get really pissed off at you, and you'll probably lose all your friends. So for the random drum set lick, I wrote out 64 measures, which will be broken up into two bar phrases, so 32 cards total. And for my other random lick videos, I would pick a card and then put it back into the cowbell. For this one, you know, I took so much time writing all these, I'm just gonna pick one and then remove it and end up picking all of them. So cowbell is gonna randomly pick half of them, which is 16, and then we'll copy and paste that from the MuseScore document into a new document. Then Little Peanut wants to do some improv, so he'll get a little feature, he'll just make up whatever he randomly feels like. Then we will randomly pick the remaining 16 cards. Another thing I'm gonna change is the release. For my other random licks, I just straight up didn't do one. <laughs> but I thought of something more random. I asked my morning people to compose a comment letting me know what I should do as the release of the random drum set lick. Once again, you can become a morning person and determine the fate of these videos by just clicking that subscribe button. And the most liked comment was from Toplin Joplin Coplin Goplin, random timpani lick with nine drums, duh. So you guys want me to end the random drum set lick with another random lick. I like it, that's really random. But unfortunately, I do not have access to timpani because I use the Commandant's own gear for most of these videos and we don't have timpani. Maybe someday I'll be able to drop 20 grand on a set of nine timpani. That day is not today though. Did I mention I have a Patreon account? But. I did make a video at my school a few years ago. I did a Game of Thrones song, and in this song, I played a timpani solo with nine drums. If you wanna watch this crazy video, I'll leave the link for it below. So what I'll do for you guys is, I will release the random drum set lick with <laughs> this timpani solo from a completely different video. I think that's really random, random enough for this. All right, I'm all queued up to go on MuseScore here. Like I said, I'm just gonna copy and paste off of the original licks into the finished lick score. I will also include the MuseScore document in the description for those of you trying to do this, just so it'll be easy to copy and paste it the way I'm doing. All right, we got all 64 licks right here. We're gonna put them into the cowbell. Oh, this is her favorite part. Okay, first one. We got lick number CC, which goes. Okay, so select, copy, 
click and paste and yeah, awesome. Okay, cool. Wait, why does that look weird? Oh wait, we're in a different time signature. Okay. Oh man, this is gonna take some effort. Okay, we're discarding that one. And now we're picking the next one. Got lick A. Okay, I'm gonna fast forward through most of this because this takes freaking forever and it's not really that exciting. But just know that some of these drum licks are like famous, well-known drum licks. And other ones are just random crap that I've thought of. Okay, we made it to measure 33, which is the halfway point in which Lil Peanut will do his little improv solo. And since we're now halfway through this, I feel like this would be a good time to announce that when I reach 69,069 subscribers and have 6969 of those subscribers ring the Liberty Bell, I will post a very special video where I compose a cadence entirely of sixlets, ninelets, and sixty-ninthlets. And we just hit 30k subscribers, so we are almost halfway there. Halfway there! Halfway there! So don't forget to click the subscribe button and ring the Liberty Bell. Okay, moving on with the lick, let's see what we're gonna start out with after the improv. We got lick N. Have I been saying like number N? I think I said that at the beginning. We got lick number N, which goes like ding 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 check and gank a ding 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 check and gank. There it is! We got double D's! So here's this video's D lick. Okay, so there it is, the random drum set lick written out, and of course ending with the random timpani lick with nine drums. Duh. Okay, so this is a beast of a drum set solo. We got 64 bars plus improv plus a timpani lick. You ready for this, little peanut? I'm scared. All right, let me just check here. Is it? Oh yeah, it's time to get random. Let's go! Let's go!
random drum set lick. I hope you all liked this video. If you did, make sure you click the subscribe button and ring the liberty bell and also click the like button. And also buy a custom t-shirt such as this one. I'll leave the link in the description. And also make sure that you post videos for the hardest glockenspiel feature of 2019. And also post your random drum set lick videos. And have a good morning. Oh. <laughs> I look cool. You look super hip. You should pop the collar. Did you help? Yeah. That's good? Okay. <laughs>